if we move on, the next page is the semester schedule at a glance. I've kind of color coded it a little bit here because it gets a little bit confusing. Um, the semester schedule at a glance is for all sections of Art 1200, whether you're taking this online or as a flipped classroom hybrid or as a Monday, Wednesday, or Tuesday, Thursday traditional on-campus class. And so when you're looking at this, you have to kind of interpret it for your means. And so if you're taking an online class and it says that on Wednesday and Thursday, the first week of the class, you should be completing those things that I said. And you should be reading the module to learning objectives and starting the lecture on printing, packaging, and exporting. That means that you have the entire week or from Wednesday until Saturday, if it's a half week, um, if, it's, if it's only half a week, you have from from Wednesday to Saturday to get down what you need to get done. So you can decide that you're going to do it on Wednesday or Thursday, like they would do it on a Tuesday, Thursday, or Wednesday, uh, Monday, Wednesday class. Um, or you could say, I'm going to do it on Friday morning, or I'm going to do a little bit on Wednesday, and a little bit on Thursday, and a little bit on Friday, and a little bit on Saturday. Um, in the right-hand column, it will show you what to do that week. And so you'll see that in the blue highlighting, I'm saying this is all module one. And so for module one, you have to submit activities 1.1, 1.2, 1.3, and 1.4. In addition, I posted Adobe videos within the module and I would like you to watch them. If we're looking at the first week of the semester, and this is just for the semester I'm recording this, in the spring semester, summer semester, it will have a different set of requirements. I also want you to start module two by reading the learning objectives to get an idea of what's required. And then I would like you to start the lecture. Maybe just watch it. Don't take any notes. Don't worry about memorizing it, but watch it to get an idea of what you'll be doing next week. In addition, I would like you to watch the Adobe videos. Now, if you're taking this on campus, the same idea applies. You would look at this and say, I'm taking this as a Monday, Wednesday class. So I can expect that during class on Wednesday, we're gonna do all these things that are listed. And then by Saturday, I need to do all of these things. Um, when it comes to watching the Adobe videos, there's no submission for that, so obviously you just have to do that before you come to class the next day. And if it's a Monday, Wednesday class, you have to watch it by Monday. The reason that I've color coded the things is so you can see kind of what you're working on and what module it's associated with. And so the first module is all colored blue, and the second module is all colored green, and then the third module is all colored yellow. And so visually, you can see that you're going to spend two weeks working on module three, but only one and a half weeks working on module two. And then I just repeated that pattern so that you can see kind of where the break is in the modules. Not, mo not many of them kind of overlap after the third one, but it does get a little confusing at the beginning of the semester because we kind of say, okay, module one, week one, module two, week two, but I would like you to start module two early. I would recommend printing this page. We will stick to this page and it will not change unless like the world ends or we get a, a snow day for some reason. But I've been here at the college, this is my seventh year, and we have not had one snow day. So the likelihood of that is pretty low.